don't even know what to talk about. Let us try to see something spontaneously. So I'm still here in Switzerland and slowly, slowly recovering. All of those things that happened when I was in India and Nepal, you know, it was too much, it was so much for me and so many impressions and so many things happened and so many things happened within myself. It was very tough for me, it was not very easy for me to stand all of that and now I feel like I have lots of things to digest, lots of food to digest. It feels like you're coming back to your home, to your home, and in your room you see even many, many things all around. I think somebody sent you lots of, lots of, lots of, lots of things, you know? And you will have to put those things into their places. You will have to find places for those things, and you know that it's gonna take some time. Because there are awfully lots of things, you know? So in the same way I feel. I feel like I need quite some time to get back to my center and stand again still within myself and stable. But I'm getting back. Trying to practice as much as I can. It's not very easy when you are among other people. It's not practice. It's not easy to practice those meditations and so on. And to be honest, I'm tired of everything, tired of all of the practices, of meditations, of all of the people preaching about spirituality and so on. I'm tired of meditation. And the thing I do is, the meditation I practice is not meditation, and I'm not practicing it. I'm just myself, I'm just being with myself and feeling what I feel, doing what I do. When I love, then I love. When I laugh, then I laugh. I'm just trying to, I'm just being myself, you know. And I don't want to call it meditation because I'm tired of meditation. I had enough meditations in my life to realize that um, it's boring. I want to do something and express myself into this world the way I can to bring out those realizations and that love that I have and while I was in India and Nepal I started writing a book and I wish to find inspiration to continue on that because you know sometimes you just stop and you don't know what to write and you know no inspiration is coming you're just trying to write but Nothing happens. In the same way I'm trying to do something, but it feels like I'm still waiting for something. Anyways, I just wanted to thank you again. If not you, I wouldn't be here and I wouldn't do what I do. You gave me inspiration to do what I do and to try to express myself. I think that's enough for this time.